Hello everyone. Welcome to the channel Knowledge24. We know that Bluetooth is used for exchanging information like text, pictures, images, videos, etc. between the fixed or mobile devices like mobiles, laptops, speakers, keyboard, mouse, etc. over the short distance. So, Bluetooth is used for productivity and comfort. At the same time, it can also present major security threats or risk. So, in this lecture, we will see what are the different type of Bluetooth attacks and how to prevent from these attacks. So, let's start with types of the Bluetooth attack. Mainly, we have three types of Bluetooth attack. The first one is blue jacking, then second is blue snapping and then third is blue bugging. Let's start with the blue jacking. It is a harmless technique that is used for sending the anonymous or unwanted message or information or pictures or sound to a Bluetooth enabled devices with the help of Bluetooth connection within a certain limited range. OBEX protocol is used for exchanging the information between the devices. Here OBEX is the protocol which stands for Object Exchange Protocol. The main purpose of blue jacking is to interact with new people, then advertising, promoted adverb games, then for marketing strategies, then for the spam messages and for gorilla marketing. Blue jacking is a harmless attack because it's only used for sending the message to the other devices. But they have no control on the devices of the victim and they will not hack the devices. Suppose if you get these type of message then you have to delete these message or never respond to the blue checkers. Now the second is blue snapping. It is different from the blue jacking. It is a harmful attack in which mobile phone is illegally hacked via Bluetooth by connecting with the Bluetooth enabled devices without the user's knowledge and access the information like contact details, then phone book, then calendar, messages, pictures or videos etc. So their purpose is to theft the information. Now the third one is blue bugging. It is more harmful than the others too. It allows to take full access control of the other device through the enabled Bluetooth devices. Full control means accessing or alter the information like set call forwarding, then listen the calls, receive the call, then make the calls and copy or download the pictures and images and other type of thing without the owner's knowledge. If your device behaves unexpectedly, then firstly you have to disconnect the Bluetooth and reset your device to factory setting. It will erase all the data and application including that have been criminally installed. So these are the basic attacks of the Bluetooth and these all type of attacks are mainly occurs in the places in the crowd places like railway station, shopping malls, restaurant etc. Now if you want to prevent from these type of attacks then general precautions is that the setting of your Bluetooth device to hidden, invisible or 
non discoverable mode and disable the bluetooth when it is not used so these are the basic general precautions saving from the different type of bluetooth attacks thank you